Same course, but they'll lower the bars, which means that we are ready now for the finals of the small dog agility competition. Harry and Anna Erickson from Shrewsbury, Massachusetts will be the first ones to attack this course and set the time to beat. Harry, a miniature schnauzer, getting ready to attack the course. Over, watch it. Problems going up on the dog walk and problems coming off of it. They missed that contact. Remember, coming off of the green obstacles, they must touch that yellow zone as they exit. That'll cost them. 10 additional seconds. You have to be clean in the finals. Come on, go, 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 go. Everything else looking good. Nice to the weave pulls. Over. Harry always looking for direction. Where do I go next? Where do I go next? Over. Go, pose. Come on. Oh, confusion. Go. Go That'll go cost on. him fractions of time. No fall points, just additional time. And that is across the finish line in a time of 44.05. With 10 additional fall points, though, 54.05. Disappointment for this team. Yeah, that was a nice run, but this cost them big time as they come up over the dog rock right there. As you can see, he pushes off too soon, does not touch the yellow zone before going to the ground, and that's 10 seconds added on. Very good. And next up, it's KC and Jerry Precop hey, hey. from right here in the Garden State, New Jersey, playing in front of the hometown crowd. KC is a Shetland Sheepdog, and remember, okay. as we said right before, here. the height Over. of the jumps Up. is set to the height of the dog's Touch. withers, which is the top of the okay. shoulder blades. Right here. Over. Over. KC, right here, right here, right here. Listen Over. to the verbal commands. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Over. Back walk. She works KC through Touch. that box nicely okay. and Shoot. on through the course. They're having a good run. KC, come. Tunnel. KC, come. Back weave. Get it, go. Small dog right style, here. hopping over. through the weave Go pulls. On, nice on. job, it was fast. Wait. Okay, over. Weave, 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 weave. Get it, go, 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 go. And a clean run oh. so far. And again, that is going to make sure and give them the You're lead on. right now. The time to beat was 54.05. They come through in a time of 40.85 seconds. Wow, creamed the leader off the top. Take a look here. This is where we were really hearing her with the verbal commands, directing KC through the difficult box area. More so than I think her body or hand positioning, the verbal commands directed the dog to the right spot and made it quick and tight again, cutting off those precious seconds. And so Leo and Lindsay Mulligan know what they need to do from East Brunswick, New Jersey. They've got to beat KC in a time okay. of 40.85 seconds. Go bottom. Leo a little pappy on. Leo, come in here, come, come, come. Here, come here, come. A little bit fast. Back. That's a little bit of a wide turn right there. That's where you cut off fractions of time. He's been making the turns between obstacles tighter. Yay, come tunnel. Leo has hit all of those important contact areas though. So no fall points so far. Jump, get back, Teeter. Stay, bottom. Some little barks of excitement there through the poles. Jump. Get out, we, 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 we. Shh. You hear that quite often. The owners will, will give that shh, that hissing sound to get them through the weave poles. And is it in time? It is. 39.85 seconds. Congratulations as Leo moves up into first place. Leo looking great through the weave poles in small dog style, hopping through since the body length's shorter. It's the best way for them to do it. And our final team out here in the small dog competition, Jag and Aaron Schaefer from Foxborough, Massachusetts. They have to get through in a time of at least 39.85 seconds. Anything faster than that, and they will be our champions. Making sure to get those contact zones. She really slowed him down there to be uh, safe instead of sorry. Round, round, go. This is a fast Jack. dog. I see why she slowed him there to make sure he hits the yellow. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Boy, barely got that contact Jack. zone coming off the A-frame. Let's go, let's go. Get out, weave. Weave, let's go. I don't know. This is looking like a fast and clean run. Seesaw. 39.85 is the weave. time to beat. The top two finishers here qualify for the national championships. It is coming down to the wire and across in a time. 
of 39.66 seconds, and so by mere tenths of a second, it is Aaron Schaefer and her dog, Jag, that will represent the East at the national championships. They played it safe right there, made Jag stay on the teeter-totter till it hit the ground so he did not miss that yellow contact zone. Safe but fast, and that's what got them through the entire course clean. And so our top two teams will represent the East in St. Louis for the national championships, and that means Jag and Aaron Schaefer and Leo and Lindsey Mulligan. Well, Aaron, you and Jag put on quite a performance out there today. You got to feel great about this. Thank you. I do feel very good about this. And what made it all kind of come together? Lots of practice, or was today just your day? I think today was just our day. It was a fast course and fun, and he did a good job on it. Good job. Well, you are champions, and we're going to see you at the national finals in St. Louis. Okay, thank All you. right, thanks. Back to you.